Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another Bible Study Minute. Today we're taking a look at Genesis chapters 31 and 32. And after 20 years of working for his uncle Laban, the Lord speaks to Jacob and tells him to finally return to his homeland. Now, Jacob does this in a way that's pretty deceitful. He doesn't tell Laban that he's leaving. And he does this so that he feels he's not cheated or deceived once again and leaving with nothing or without any of his family. So all that happens. And then, of course, Rachel does what she does. And it's a it's a, a mess once again. But what we see here is a beautiful picture because eventually Laban and Jacob are able to reconcile. And then we see Jacob preparing to try to reconcile and seek forgiveness from his brother Esau. And in the midst of this, we get a really honest prayer from Jacob in chapter 32, verse 9, in the verses that follow, where Jacob is just praying to God in a really honest way. Probably the most honest prayer that he's ever prayed in his life. Saying, you know what, God... I'm scared, don't know what's going to happen, but you've made these promises to me and you've been faithful so far and I haven't deserved any of it, but I'm asking you to just kind of be with me in this time. And that's what I want us to focus on today in this passage is even with everything else that's going on in these passages, look at this really honest prayer. Are you praying those kind of prayers in your own life? And if you're not, I challenge you today to pray to God. A really honest prayer from your heart and pray back those promises to him from scripture so that's what i got for you today and until next time grace and peace